Hey you guys, good morning. Making my morning juices this morning. And um, I wasn't gonna film, but then I had the, the intuition to um, show you guys a new recipe that I literally discovered yesterday. So yesterday I was making my juices in the morning and I realized I had some eggplant in the fridge. Um, and I asked myself, uh, can I juice eggplant? So I had my sister Google, can you juice eggplant? And of course, Dr. Google said yes. <laughs> so I juiced up some eggplant yesterday and I actually really, really enjoyed it to my surprise. Um, eggplant is really, really good for you. Any foods that sort of in the purple category are really, really good for you, have a lot of um, nutrients, antioxidants. I heard eggplant is really, really good for the female reproductive system, for all that area down there. So really, really good for you. Um, I'm learning how to really enjoy them um, through steaming or other ways of cooking. So today I just wanna show you how I juice an eggplant and what the eggplant juice looks like. Um, this is, I just chopped up here and I wish I had showed you what the eggplant looked like. It was the smaller baby eggplants and I just chopped up, I think this is four chopped up here. Um, and I'm gonna blend it in my high power blender um, here with just a little bit of water. You all know I don't have a juicer, so I'm gonna strain just with a cheesecloth um, nutmeg bag that I got on Amazon. Um, so I'll quickly show you that, but just before I do that, I just wanna show you I've already made my um, my juices, some of my juices for this morning. So this is, um, uh, today it's cranberry, cranberry, what did I put in here? Cranberry ginger lemon for today. Um, and I will have this, um, it's like I put warm water in here or yeah, warm water and, um, I'll have this over the course of the day. So it's kind of like my drink, go-to drink, no sugar, nothing added, no honey, um, cranberry ginger lemon blended up and then strained and put in here and then I added some water and then this is my celery juice um, for today and then this is my cucumber juice um, so again some cucumber juice stuff and I'll show you guys how to make these videos later but today the focus is the eggplant so um, eggplants washed chopped I'm just gonna put them in the blender here And I think I've done a product link on my last video for this blender, but I, I will do that again if you're interested in getting one. Um, I got it for my birthday last year, so I just added the water. I got it for my birthday last year, and it was literally sitting in my um, garage, and I just was not on and let it blend at high power. It's really noisy when it blends, so FYI. Let it blend at high power for um, how long the high power lasts, which I think is... Um, 60 minutes uh, and it does its own thing so I can put it on quickly run to check my emails do whatever I need to do so I love this blender it's so good so let's blend it and let's see what the pulp looks like and how I strain <laughs> feeling like this will strain no problem but I really like to not get rid of pulp or not have so much pulp when I strain um so I'm just going to add just one more little cup of water to it and blend it again just so I can, can get more juice out of the um out of the pulp right I, I don't want to throw out all that pulp so I'm let water me, and let's do this again so this is the consistency with the added water I think I like this consistency better it just just looks more blended and I think it'll be, we'll get a lot of good pulp out of this. So I'm going to pour it in the cup in the, um, let me show you what I'm gonna strain with. So in here is just um, a measuring cup here. And then um, I have a nutmeg bag that I got off of Amazon. I can link that as well. Um, and sorry, it looks a little uh, dirty this morning because I used it to strain. Um, the celery and the cucumber juice that I made this morning. So um, I've rinsed it out. I mean, it's all it's all going into my body and it's all clean and good for me. So I'm going to pour this in here. It's to the brim um, and simply just 
cool part. Just squeeze it out. The cheese is a little warm <laughs> because of um, the blender. A little bit left in here, um, so I'll, I'll probably strain that after, but I won't bore you with that process. But I think we get the process. So this is the um, the juice essentially. tell you what it tastes like. I'm going to take a sip. Mm. It's it tastes like eggplant juice. <laughs> and then it's, it's not bad. Like it doesn't taste bad or anything. I mean, I know what I'm drinking. So it tastes like eggplant. Um, let me take another sip. It's a bit bitter because I think the seeds in the eggplant are bitter. Um, but yeah, I have no concerns with this. I'm happy to drink it and I will drink it over the course of the day with all my other juices. So yeah, no problem here. Um, there you have it, eggplant juiced. And that's about four eggplants juiced. And yeah, um, let me know what you guys think. Give it a try and let me know if you like it. Let me know. Um, if you enjoy it, what you think of the taste, what other videos you want to see, like, subscribe my channel, and we'll keep it going.